Hi, I'm Adam Drake from Losi, and I'm going to show you how I thread lock the set screws for my center drive shafts on my vehicle, and also how I help make them last longer and actually function better by using Losi's high pressure grease. The products you'll need is Losi Nitrotec cleaner or any electric motor spray or contact cleaner, Losi thread lock, and also Losi high pressure black grease. What we have here is a center rear drive shaft for a Losi 8 2.0. Uh, installing this, one of the most important things is just making sure everything is really, really clean. Uh, that way the thread lock has, has a good chance to actually bond and, and work properly. What I'll do is I'll just spray in the corner of my shop towel here, a little bit of Nitrotech cleaner. Take the set screw, pinch it and clean it. And as you can see here, there's a lot of dirt and grime that just comes off the screw um, that would generally hinder the bond uh, with the thread lock. So now with both set screws clean, you want to do the same thing with the coupler, the pin, just basically all the metal parts. Just spray a little bit of cleaner on everything to make sure any oil or grease is, is clean. You want to just go ahead and let that air dry, wipe it off here on the towel. And then what I do is I actually take the thread lock and I'll put a small amount of the thread lock down in the threads and then also on the set screw. Then I'll take the set screw and actually run it into the coupler making sure that the thread lock is coated all the way throughout the threads. Then I'll take a small amount of thread lock and reapply it to the set screw here. Take the coupler in your gearbox here, make sure that you're on the flat of the pinion. And then you want to make sure that this coupler is pushed onto the pinion, but not, not so tight that it binds up the bearings. This should spin really, really free. Once you have it set to where you have maybe just a slight amount of backlash, you can go ahead and really, really crank down on this set screw. Again, check just to make sure that everything spins free. And then you'll do the same thing with, that, with the drive shaft coupler. Put a small amount of thread lock down in the threads, a small amount on the set screw. Run the set screw all the way in, and then back it out. a little bit more thread lock to the screw. Again, it's very important to make sure that you line up the flat on this pin to make sure uh, you get good grip with your set screw. Just barely snug the set screw and make sure that the pin is centered on the coupler. And then again, just crank that baby down. Make sure it's as tight as possible. And then generally, I like to let that dry for a few minutes before I grease the out dry or grease the center drive shaft. But Losi has this really neat, just very simple drive shaft boot. You just pop this over the dog bone. Take your low C high pressure grease and just apply it in the joint here. And you take your boot, slide it down, push it over. And the grease will really, really help reduce the amount of friction and increase the life of your drive shaft. It also will help if you happen to not get a good bond with your set screw and it and it happens to come out it'll also help hold that pin in but it's mainly used just just to increase the life of the drive shaft by keeping that grease packed in there